Dolgin, D-O-L-G-I-N, AKA High Voltage, and I'm the founder of Energy Up Health and Wellness. I choose to be a sugar-free school. My organization has been in the school system here in New York for 10 years, and this year we are proud to be spearheading the first I Choose to Be Sugar-Free School. And it is so important to support Mayor Bloomberg. And as New Yorkers, we need to be so proud that we have a mayor and a health department that will stand up and say things that may not sound popular, but are actually here to help save people's lives. When I first got into the schools, sugar, first of all, has no business in New York City schools. Sugar is a drug. If sugar today came onto the market, it would never just be passed the way it is and be in everything. Our signature activity, Sugar Shock, which we set up here on the steps of City Hall, and some of you after the press conference, we'd love to really show you how it works. Sugar Shock, when we speak to parents and teachers and our educational programs, even when they first heard about this initiative, they're like, but this is a free country. They can't tell us what to do. I'm like, you're looking at this wrong. You have to understand, first of all, sugar is not harmless. When we measure out and show parents and teachers how much sugar is in everything, and specifically these supersized sodas, it is enough sugar to start causing harm and health to our body. This is a health issue we also can't afford. It's bankrupting our country, our city. We have got to now stand up for our mayor, stand up for our health department, and get out there, go to the neighborhoods, and share the information that sugar is like a drug for billions of people. Anything over six to seven teaspoons a day starts causing harm. There are over 22 teaspoons in one of those large um, sugar sweet beverages. So we're out here today, and like-minded people joining forces, and Energy Up is in the house, and we're here to say, Energy up! Woo! Mayor Bloomberg, we support you. God bless and let's kick SSBs to the curb.